All right, all right. All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rahrakakwadash, and double honors always be to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Mr. Brother Yahweh coming at you with another lesson to edify and comfort the Lord's elect. So, Lord willing, that this video is edifying. 2023, the hopeful year that all prophecies be fulfilled, and that's right, we pray and hope that all prophecies come to pass. All right, especially in these times. All right, especially in these times. And here you see it. As you brothers see on the screen, this is from uh, a post where a brother had posted. And you see uh, different articles on the screen how these uh, newscasters all right, are being fired, such as Don Lemon, Tarko Carson, Salakia, and uh, Lou Dobos. All right. And as you see, it says breaking news Don Lemon is fired from by CNN. Also, Tucker Carson out of Fox News Network says they have agreed to part ways. And Fox News cancel Lou Dobes show pro Trump host not expected to be on air. All right. And this also is a this is a prelude to what's going to come. All right. The Esau is orchestrating. All right. For persecution. All right. And also the famine of the word. Because we in that time. Where this word have been getting out. And these elites. The higher ups. They see that their kingdom. Is beginning to fall. Well it's falling. Not beginning to fall. But it's falling. And it's falling fast. All right. Because the Lord got his prophets. The servants of the Lord on the streets. All right. Proclaiming the names of Yahweh. Why Yahweh Shai. And prophesy against the evildoers. All right. Chanting Babylon the great down. And ultimate Esau, he's going to have to come with persecution. Okay. He's going to have to come with, you know, shutting down the internet according to biblical prophecies. And we're coming in that time. That's why you see in all these newscasters, all right, these so called quote unquote whistleblowers, they're being, um, they're being fired and taken off social media, so to speak. All right. And that's soon to come to the Israelites, all right, the ministry. Where Esau is going to come down having great wrath, all right, in a time of, of, of trouble, okay? So, you know, we're just going to jump right into it. This is Job 5 and verse 21. Thou shalt be hid from the scourges of the tongue, neither shall be afraid of destruction when it's come. That's right, we're going to be hid from the scourges of the tongue, all right? Because Esau, the devil that he is, he hates the words of the Heavenly Father, all right? He's all about... Uh, the vibration of a wickedness of Satan. All right. And soon he's going to come to top to try to stop this word from being uh, to apprehend the word from coming out. But the scripture says that the word of the heavenly father go out, not void. It return to him, not void. All right. That it shall prosper in his way. And it's going to prosper in the ways of the minds of the elect. All right. See the elect hear the words of the Lord. All right. The word is going out, and there's nothing you devils can do about it. All right, this is all biblical prophecy, man. Okay, you shutting down the internet, you trying to persecute different brothers, trying to demonize. All right, this is all part of uh, biblical prophecy. So you're moving through the through the through the movement of the Lord, because we know that time is coming where these people are not going to be able to hear the word of the Lord. This is Amos 8 and verse 11. Behold, the days come, save the Lord power, that I will send a famine in the land, not a famine of bread, nor thirst for water, but hearing the words of the Lord. That's right. See? And that's talking about your internet being shut down. You know? Your brother's not on the highways and byways. All right? Due to chaos on the street, due to Esau coming with oppression, trying to demonize the uh, Israelite movement. You know, this is all coming. And it says, they shall wander from sea to sea, from north even to the east. They shall run to and fro to seek the word of the Lord and shall not find it. That's right, man. See, these people are going to be seeking for a truth, but they're not going to be able to find it. Because now it's the time now to hear the words of the Lord before the evil days come not. So, you know, that, that, that time of persecution, that famine of the word is coming quickly. All right. And you're going to see so-called Morty, so-called whistleblowers being taken off the air. All right. Being uh, banned from certain social medias because Esau hate. 
He hate the word. All right. He hate rebuke. This is Amos 5 and verse 10. They hate him that rebuke in the gate and they abhor him that speak uprightly. That's right. See, they hate the words of the heavenly father. All right. These devils, um, they, they hate righteousness. All right. Let me see if I can bring this up. In. Yep. Let me read uh, Salakia. Yep. Let me read this one. This is uh, Luke six and verse twenty-two. Blessed are ye when men shall hate you, and we shall separate, and, and they shall separate you from their company, and ye and shall reproach you and cast out your name as evil for the Son of Man's sake. And that's right. That's what Esau ultimately trying to do: cast our name out as evil. All right. That's why you send all these uh, AI. Um, voice recorders, you know, they're doing AI, have it where certain people, they're using certain people, um, and they're pushing it out that, you know, they're saying certain things, but it'd really be AI, you know. I forgot what it's called. Oh, man. Um, damn. Oh, man. Um, oh, man. But basically, man, they can have it where it'd be picture your face, you know, look just like you, but it's not your voice, you know. So Esau, man, he hey, he's moving as the devil, as, as the Bible speaks of, you know. So we're going to be blessed. It says, blessed are ye when men shall hate you. That's right, man. You know, and that time of hate is coming very uh, fast, you know. So, hey, man, hey, it's here. We here. Now it's the time to grasp hold unto the word more so than ever. Because soon it's about to be a blockage on the internet. All right. And things are moving fast. Okay. So, you know, brothers, a hey, time to gear up in the spirit. You know, continue to uh, watch well as pray. Continue to be built up. All right. So, with that, I came to pray the lesson was edifying, comforting, and exhorting to you, brothers, as well as your few sisters that listen and learning. I'm going to give all the praise and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashim. Abra Kakodash. Till next time, Shalom.